1919, Boston faced perhaps the strangest disaster in human history. A massive tidal wave crushed a neighborhood, but it wasn't water. It sounds funny, a flood of sweet, sticky syrup. But the reality was horrifying. It the source was a gigantic storage tank, 50 feet tall, holding over 2 million gallons of thick molasses meant for industrial alcohol. The tank was built cheaply and quickly. It leaked so badly the company painted it brown just to hide the drips instead of fixing it. On an unusually warm January day, the metal groaned. Then, boom, the rivets popped like machine gun fire as the tank ripped open. A tidal wave of sludge, 25 feet high, roared through the streets at 35 miles per hour. The force was unimaginable. It snapped steel girders, crushed buildings flat, and knocked an entire elevated train engine off its tracks. The horror was the thickness. Unlike water, you couldn't swim in molasses. If you fell, you were stuck instantly, suffocating in the goo. Cleanup took weeks using saltwater fire hoses. For decades, locals claimed they could still smell sweet molasses on hot summer days. It wasn't a joke, it was a tragedy born of negligence. Click here for another historical disaster that sounds fake but actually happened.